99mm USA here, and this is going to be a review of these Ameriglow Spartan Tactical Operator Night Sights for the Glock 43 or 42. These are fantastic sights made by Ameriglow. They are all metal construction to replace the quite honestly garbage <laughs> Glock factory plastic sights. You know, here are the plastic factory sights. They're just not very good. The Spartan sights have a very similar setup to the Trigicon HD night sights, other than the fact that the HD sights have a few more features and are more expensive. Here are the HD sights right here on my Walther PPQ and 9mm. The HD sights have a wide U notch. It's got a very wide cutout on the rear sight. The Trigicon HD's rear sight also has serrations to reduce glare. And the orange paint on the Trigicon HDs is luminescent around the tritium insert. Now between these two sight sets, I actually prefer the Ameriglow Spartan sights. As they are a little bit more precise when aiming. Check out the difference here. You can see that it's just a square notch on the Ameriglow Spartan in comparison to the wide U notch right there. So there's not as much air between the sights on the Ameriglow Spartans which makes them better for accuracy, in my experience. And the tritium inserts on the Spartan sights are a little bit larger and, in my experience, a little bit brighter in comparison to the Trigicon HD sights. So I think they're better overall. All right, guys, check out those Ameriglow Spartan sights. Very nice on the Glock 43. Really gets you on target really fast. Right. The Spartan sights do have a three dot tritium insert set up. So here is your tritium inserts in the rear. No serrations on the rear sight to reduce glare, which is fine as it adds a little bit more cost. But you can see right here that it does say Trigicon on the back. So the inserts actually in these sights, there is also one in the front, are made by Trigicon. All right, guys, we're going to be testing the Glock 43, which is hot now, in this Mica pocket holster, all leather. We'll do a full review on these later. but It's a uh, very nice pocket holster. Good quality. Handmade. Now this version of the Spartan Operator sights has orange paint around the front sight. It is not luminescent paint on this version of the Operator sights. However, on the yellow front side version of these sights, the paint is luminescent, meaning that if you have a light source such as sunlight or a flashlight, putting a certain amount of light on the paint, it will glow for a couple minutes in the dark. Let's see if this is enough uh, power to make it glow. As you can see, it is glowing a little bit. I didn't apply a whole lot of light on there, and normally it takes a thousand lumens to make it glow for a couple minutes. This is a 500 lumen flashlight. Now to put my personal preference out there, I prefer the yellow front sight version of these sights. And Optics Planet doesn't offer them on their website for the Glock 43, so I'm going to leave a link in the description box below directly to Ameriglow's website where you can order the yellow luminescent front sight version of these sights. Either way, regarding the personal preference choice of the front sight paint color, these are truly fantastic sights. The Spartan sights will significantly help draw your attention, aka your dominant eye, to that front sight. So you easily can ignore the rear sight and pay attention to the front sight over the rear sight, which will help you aim faster and shoot better overall. If you do prefer the orange paint version around the tritium insert over the yellow, I'll leave a link below to purchase these sights over at OpticsPlanet.com. If you guys are interested in these sites or anything else available at OpticsPlanet.com, make sure you use our discount code B9USA for 5% off your entire order. And by doing so, you are supporting our channel, which we thank you guys greatly for because without you guys subscribing to our channel and liking our videos, a honest review like this would not be possible to make as we wouldn't be getting the gear to review for you guys out there. So we definitely greatly appreciate your guys' support. Well, you guys, that's the end of this review. I hope you enjoyed it. As always, everyone, thanks for watching the video. And remember to like, share, and subscribe to our channel here on YouTube, Brett and I, Millimeter USA, for more guns and gear videos coming up in the future.